How very strange. <laughs> the path ahead was blocked, but this wouldn't stop the great wizard, Amadeus. With his magic, he could lift objects. The light moved through the forest, leading Amadeus further. Torn between fear and... I demand to know what's happening. Pontius had headed out that evening, for there was trouble on the peasant farms. Creeping vines were taking over the fields. A warlock must be behind this devilry. I'll find him and teach him a lesson with my sword. With luck, there'll be pumpkin pie for dinner tonight. Pontius searched the farm, but saw no one there. The nasties must have fled at the sight of me. Whoa! Oh, 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 that looks dangerous. Be nasty, weeds. I'll show you what for. I'm Pontius the Brave. I won't fall in a battle with dandelions! <gasps> the Trine! Pontius had never understood what exactly the Trine did. Late that night, Zoya was concealed in the shadows, hidden from the shimmering moonlight. passed through the town as quietly as a whisper. Then she saw a glimmering light moving on top of the old church. Hmm. The trine, how inconvenient. What are you doing here in the middle of the night? Not back to your old tricks and thievery. <laughs> oh, there's a perfectly good explanation for this.